This demo will present compelling reasons why an organization should utilize OrgChart to enable more effective workforce decisions. Executives and department heads can utilize OrgChart to quickly answer workforce-related questions, plan for workforce change, and make better decisions, providing a tangible ROI for workforce management. OrgChart accepts data from various sources. In this video, we will focus on Excel. It's important to have two columns that uniquely identify the hierarchy as shown. You can determine the box layout in this step by simply selecting the desired fields. OrgChart can automatically format the assistant style based on criteria in your data source. Setting the value to yes for a record makes the corresponding box an assistant. Large data sets can easily be divided into subcharts. Here, we are creating the subcharts at level 2 and using the department column from your data source as a naming convention. After you have verified that the hierarchy is correct, the chart will be imported automatically. You can also move the entire chart down on the page should you wish to use chart titles and then simply click on the navigation arrows to navigate to the subcharts. OrgChart makes it easy for users to change the box layout, add new columns and even display photos with just a few clicks. A box can contain any number of fields. A field represents information such as name, title, phone number or photos. With OrgChart, you can now create calculations even faster. OrgChart is bundled with the most common predefined calculated fields, making it easier for you to create headcounts. OrgChart also allows you to create your own calculated fields based on information from your own data set as shown here. Note that calculations can also be based on criteria from your data source to answer those pressing KPI questions. OrgChart allows you to take large data sets and display them over a number of pages. Use auto text elements like automated division naming, page numbers, calculated fields, and date info to name just a few. The master page will ensure that each page in your project has a consistent look and feel. Simply drag and drop the elements on the master page to activate them. The summary field value element is a great tool to display your calculated fields in the background of the chart page as opposed to a particular person's box layout. OrgChart allows you to change your box format based on criteria from your data source For example, changing all the boxes that are indicated in your data source as female to red boxes and all the male records to blue boxes. Changing the font style can easily be done by editing the box properties. Note that you can edit all the fields individually or all at once as shown here. OrgChart lets you easily navigate the subcharts by simply clicking the navigation arrows 
And with org chart, you only need to set up your org structure format once. As your structure changes, simply update the relevant records in your dataset and re-sync your chart, keeping the same look and feel intact. To publish a chart, open the file menu and select Publish to Interactive PDF. You have the option of not just publishing the chart, but also individual profiles of each person, along with additional page layout options. Name the file in the desired location and then save it. All you have to do is simply complete the wizard. Subchart errors are included automatically to navigate between subcharts and are hyperlinked. Your file is now ready to be distributed to your end users via PDF. For more information on OrgChart, please visit our website at www.orgchartpro.com.